Hey everybody and welcome back to another video. Today is the day. Today is our channel anniversary. Woo! Yay! <laughs> Sarah asked me if there was going to be a woo in there somewhere. And woo! We put it in there. Some Ric Flair, I suppose. Um, but this is the channel anniversary and we got some big things to talk to you about. We got some changes that are happening uh, that we're excited about. Uh, and we're just going to talk about some upcoming things as well. So, first of all, we, I think it was just about, I think it was last year that we started doing the theme song stuff. Um, and so we've had a song that plays at the very beginning with a montage of all the different things we've done on the channel in the beginning of our videos. And as of this video, we are now premiering a brand new opening for the channel. So before we debut the new one, let's go ahead and show the original one one more time here so we can all uh, enjoy it one last time. So let's check that out. We got a bidet! So that was the last time that we are going to be using that intro here on the channel. I am very excited to show you guys the brand new one. So here it is, the new theme intro for Dyad in the Rough. Check it out. The Dyad in the Force, unseen for generations, and now the power of two restores the one. We got a bidet! I don't know about you, Sarah, but I really enjoyed that new one. I think it really shows uh, a lot of the different things in the channel, a lot of the people that have been on the channel. Um, just to talk to you a little bit about where that video came from, uh, that's always the fun stuff for me is learning the behind the scenes. This channel really has grown uh, not only from a subscriber and viewership base but also from the point of view of all the people that are involved with the channel you know our friends they do not have to take time out of their day to you know have fun on the channel they don't have to do that they do it they volunteer and then we all just have a lot of fun talking about different things and making content for you and so i thought it was super important to uh, have our community be a part of it and then you, you can basically get just about everybody uh, on that video and be able to see a lot of the people that have been doing things lately. Um, so I guess one more time, let's go ahead and take a look at that intro that will be in the beginning of all the videos moving forward. So Woo! yeah, check it out. The Dyad in the Force, unseen for generations. And now, the power of two restores the one. We got a bidet!
All right, so the first thing we wanted to show you on the channel was this new intro. So that's our first huge update in this video. Um, the second thing, it's not really a new surprise. It's just kind of elaborating on it a little bit more. As you may know, we are now called Dyad in the Rough. And we used to just be my name because that's what Google just kind of slapped on there for a, a channel name. Um, but over the past couple years, I really wanted to uh, not really use my name as a brand, if that makes sense. Um, I wanted us to have something fun, not just my name. And so uh, one of the things that kind of stuck with us a little bit was... You know, we, we started out as a Star Wars channel, and it was purely Star Wars. And then we kind of branched out to see if people would receive our other interests more, too. And you guys have. And so we wanted to, it to be something Star Wars, um, but not, like, something that's super in your face about it. And so... wanted uh, to show that we were more than just Star Wars. Right. And... Honestly, even though the channel started with just me, a lot of our videos have the two of us on there. And so I thought it might be kind of cool if there's a way to incorporate two of us on there. And if it's not just me and Sarah, a lot of times it's me and somebody else. Uh, and so we were watching like the sequel trilogy for some of these videos that we've been doing Shoot the Sheaves on. And the whole idea of like the dyad relationship with ray and kylo um the fact that it has to do with two things i was like you know i bet that dyad word would be kind of interesting to have as part of our name and so uh, we were like really rambling off different things that we could put dyad in and sarah came up with what we got which is dyad in the rough yeah so why is that so perfect for us well when we started shoot the sheave if you I'm not going to say the word on the channel because we don't swear on this channel, but if you know what Shoot the Sheave is based off of, it's it's a play on words, basically. It's like Shoot the Breeze. Yeah, in a way. Um, <laughs> but we thought it would be cool to have like a play on words with the title of our channel as well. And so we're playing Dyad in the Rough off of Diamond in the Rough, um, if you didn't know that. So... Uh, we like the two-part thing, and then we also thought if we're going to have some sort of logo or picture, what would we associate with it? And so we're big Team Empire. We like the Sith. Those are like the cool bad guys in the movies of Star Wars. And if there's some, if you don't know, one of the things is that in Star Wars, there's two kyber crystals that make a red lightsaber. There's the red kyber crystal, which is the obvious one. There's also a black kyber crystal, which emits... A red light um, it's just uh, more in that Sith lore so to speak like if you watch uh, the sequel trilogy Snoke actually has a black kyber crystal on his ring so we actually do see them in the movies it's just not in your face which was perfect because like I said we didn't want something that was in your face it was subtle it was kind of one of those things where if you if you're a Star Wars fan it's like a you if you know you know kind of a thing and I just thought it was super cool. So um, we went ahead and we decided to go with Dyad in the Rough as our channel name. Uh, obviously, you might see some stuff from our previous videos that has the previous name on it. Um, but hopefully, going forward, we can get that all adjusted. Um, there is one more big, big announcement that we wanted to talk about. And uh, are we ready to... Tell them. Oh, I think we're ready. Our big announcement is that we have merch. Uh, we designed everything ourselves. So uh, you can see a little bit of mine, but I'm going to show you a better picture here in a minute. Uh, Sarah's got the same thing as far as the design. Um, we'll go ahead and show you the three different designs. Uh, this is one way that if you'd like to support the channel, you're more than welcome to. You do not have to. Um, but we think these are pretty cool. We think you're going to like them. So the first one that we have, which is probably our... Should we start with the best? Or I wouldn't say best. The flagship one? Let's start with the most iconic one, because they All already right. see it on our shirts. So this is the one... It's the main one. This is the Shoot the Sheave podcast shirt. I'm very excited about this one. 
Uh, it's probably my favorite. Um, I wanted to design something uh, where it had our main podcast in it, and that was a perfect way to do it. What kind of a cool design can I do with Sheev? And I thought this was a cool one, you know? Uh, have him with a bunch of lightning and then have uh, the name of the podcast on there. Uh, so that is one of our Shoot the Sheave shirts. We do have a second one, which I thought was really cool. Uh, the second one is we talked about how we like the play on words, right? And so we kind of took the one from Shoot the Sheave and we did an alternative one with it. And so our second one, which does have our logo on it as well, our second one is same sheave, different day. So that's pretty funny and cool one that I like. It also, like I said, it has that logo up there in the corner. So you will have the channel logo and name. And then also the uh, same sheave, different day saying on the shirt. I've never made saying shirts or anything like that. But I thought that one was super cool. And we got one more. I love puns, so I definitely am a fan of that one. Yeah, same. Uh, the last one we got here, uh, it's been, it was inspired a bit by some of our friends. Um, so when we did liquidation, if you didn't know this, uh, we got a handful of bidets while we were going through it. And the first one we ever got, I was a little surprised and uh, started the, we got a bidet. Thing going. Uh, I put it in the intro for the first one and when we were selling them or anytime we talked about them really our friends would be would just like recite that and it became kind of a thing. We got up a day! <laughs> where yeah people would just think of that because of what we did on the channel and so we created a we got a bidet shirt for the channel. Um, I think this is hilarious. It says we got a bidet. It's got a picture of a bidet and some water squirting and then the logo down there and one of the water droplets. Uh, so I love this shirt. I think it's hilarious. I think it's great for the channel. Um, these are not the only colors. There are a wide variety of colors that you can pick from. Uh, all of them we went in and personally picked for the different shirts. There's a wide variety of sizing for shirts. So. Um, just go in there, check it out, and see if there's anything you like. We would greatly appreciate uh, any support that you give us. We'd love to see our shirts out in the public. That'd be hilarious. Um, just being able to, you know, see our product. It'd be so exciting. It'd be like, oh my gosh, someone's actually wearing our product. It'd it, be, it would be awesome. Yeah. Crazy. Crazy. I, well, all of this is crazy, quite honestly. It's, it, it's a crazy feeling to feel so much support. Um, when we first started this channel, you know, it, it seemed like a very small idea, but we've grown so much that it feels so real and it feels so fun to be able to not only deliver content, but also uh, start creating some of these products um, that we really enjoy. And this isn't the only type of products that we are looking at. We are looking at a wide variety of different customizable products that we think are going to be super cool in the future. But this is kind of our starting point. So we, we have to start somewhere, right? Um, so is there anything else that we should mention on the channel? I just want to reiterate how thankful we are for everybody's support. Um, we love you guys. And uh, yeah, just thank you. Yeah, it's been really great. And it's still going very well, very well moving forward. Um, I would probably say some of the things that uh, we, maybe we can get some uh, maybe feedback from you guys is one of the biggest things that happened this year is that we put out a poll asking what kind of content you guys would like to see more of and you guys said movie discussions and that's been a, a huge thing on the channel. Um, you guys are showing us that you enjoy it so that's great. I really appreciate that. We, re we really appreciate that. Um, we've enjoyed you know, going to the movies. We've enjoyed talking to you guys about it. And so um, we're going to keep that going for sure. Um, but going along those lines is if there's anything else that you really enjoy or that you'd like us to maybe try out on the channel, um, just let us know in the comments. Uh, maybe we'll put up a poll again at some point too. 
Um, yeah, there's not a whole lot more as far as announcements, um, but I did want to give a shout out on that feedback with the, the movie discussions. Um, I've been covering MLB, the show. I've enjoyed doing that a lot, and that's getting a lot of uh, viewership as well. Um, maybe a different audience. I don't know. I don't get to see all that stuff. Um, um, obviously, we got Shoot the Sheaves coming. Um, trying to think of anything else. Black Series figures, whenever we see cool Star Wars products that we get our hands on. Um, we're hoping to show more and more Lorcana. We're going to have a little bit of that on the channel already that you've seen, but um, hoping to do more and more as it goes. It's been super hard to get those products, so we do what we can. As far as updates, I know we're kind of rambling here. We're just exciting or excited to share all of this with you. Um, so I hope you guys are excited for all these different things. And again, if you'd like to check out some of the channel merch, I'll put a link in the description of all of our videos moving forward as well. So it's easy to find. Uh, and if there's anything on there, we would very much appreciate your support. Uh, as always, everybody, thank you for watching. We'll see you next time.